Well, they did it again. I uh, don't know what to say. Let's just roll the footage. And here they are, the brand new Pokemon mystery boxes. Of course, we see that fossil pack right there on the very front. One out of every five boxes. Legend Maker, Power Keepers right there on the side, Cosmic Eclipse. In case you are curious of anything else that they currently have in stock, not a whole lot, just the usual. Your Pikachu and Eevees, your Eternatus, your Toxtricities. It's like the Breakfast Club. I say we go ahead and grab a couple and uh, try our luck. What? What is up my breaking family send it some positive vibes in your direction that is correct breaking family there is currently brand new pokemon mystery power boxes in stores right now that is if you can find them much like everything else right now pokemon related it is flying off the shelves the pokemon it craze the pokemon phenomenon is still going strong almost 20 Five years later, and right here we have the brand new Pokemon Mystery Power Boxes. We're going to open up all three of these in today's Pokemon opening. Now, if you remember earlier this year, they released this Pokemon Mystery Power Box. Almost the exact same as the one you can currently find in stores right now. Both of them retail for $25. Also, there is a chance one out of every five boxes is going to have a vintage Pokemon pack inside. I say vintage because it's a very kind of like thrown around term. Vintage is really supposed to be like 20 years or older, but everybody has their own interpretation and that's perfectly okay. Now there is just a slight difference between these two boxes right here. You can see at the bottom of the older one that was released earlier this year, five booster packs, two mystery items and one coin and one code card per box. This one right here, just a little bit different. The one currently out in stores right now, five booster packs, one bonus item, one coin, and one online code card. Now, if we take a look at the packs on the outside of the box, the older one has a Neo Discovery booster pack on it. This one right here has a Fossil booster pack on it. And then you go to the side right here, a little bit different. We got, uh, we got Legend Maker, we got EX Power Keepers on the older one. We have Platinum, we have Undaunted. Going to the back, of course, Neo Discovery once again and a Fossil once again. Pack Assortment, kind of the same at the top. The newer one does have Evolutions on the back of it, which if there's an Evolutions booster pack inside, that's really, really good right now. And then kind of the same booster packs on the other side right there. Like I said, both of these go for $25. I say we don't wait any longer. Breaking family, let's get started. Now these right here have been popping up at Walmart stores as well as uh, a Midwest retail chain called Meyer. Now these are packaged by a third party company. You can actually pause the screen and read it on the very bottom of the box. These are not packaged by the Pokemon company. Now obviously the booster packs inside of it are packaged by the Pokemon company, but this box, this product right here itself is packaged by a third party company. So let's go ahead and open it up one booster pack at a time. Let's see what we got. We have ourselves a Cosmic Eclipse. Now, one thing I would suggest not doing is buying a bunch of these in hopes that you might pull that Fossil Booster Pack. Now, a Fossil Booster Pack currently right now goes for about an unlimited version, not a first edition version, goes for about $350, $400. So if you end up buying 16 of these boxes right here, you honestly could have just went and bought a Fossil Booster Pack itself. So uh, be careful, do not spend a crazy amount of money on these hoping to get a vintage booster pack. But then again, as I always say when I open up third-party products, it's your money. Do whatever you want with your money. Who am I to say what you should do with your money? If you like these, if you want to buy them all the time, go for it. I mean, I'm not going to lie. I love a good mystery. So uh, whenever I see these, I'm always like, oh, what if, what if what is inside is absolutely amazing? So I understand. I understand Breaking Family when it comes to the mystery. Rookity, fly away, bird, fly away. Pan Sage, waving high, energy. Put that in my filing cabinet right back there. Simi Seer, Pan Seer, going into a Rainbow Rare, Eternatus V Max, Breaking Family, two booster packs in, and we already have a Rainbow Rare Pokemon card from Darkness Ablaze, one of the newer Pokemon card sets currently out as of the recording of this video. Put it right up there in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon card section. There's the code card right there. Of course, I show the code cards in every single one of my videos. So if you enjoy code cards, you know you can always come over here, grab yourself a code card whenever a new video goes up. I upload four to five times every single week. Whew. All right. 
Got all that out without stumbling over my words. Crimson Invasion is up next. Energy, Staravia, fly away, bird, fly away. We got a Slugor Stuffle going into a Primeape. All right, Primeape. If you have not seen, uh, last Friday we uploaded a brand new episode of Hidden... Well, I <laughs> should have saw that one coming. All right. All right. Okay. Okay. Should have saw that one coming. Definitely. Definitely. All right. Steam Siege. We'll take it. We'll take it. We respect Steam Siege. We love Steam Siege. We're going to treat it with the same amount of respect that we treat every single uh, Pokemon TCG set. As I was saying, though, if you did not see it last Friday's video, we uploaded a brand new episode of Hidden Pokemon Cards. I went to all brand new territory. You know, I'm from Indiana, so usually we go searching for Hidden Pokemon Cards in Indiana, but we traveled to the great state of Ohio, all brand new territory for me and the Hidden Pokemon Cards series, and we searched at a lot of stores in Ohio, lifting up a bunch of shelves. And, oh wow, what is that? I don't know what that is. It's definitely not Pokemon related. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that back down. All right, let's look underneath this one. Seeing what has been sitting under there for all of these years. Hey, Celestial Storm, don't mind. Don't mind if I do opening up a Celestial Storm booster pack. Great set. But yes, we opened up, or we lifted up a bunch of shelves at stores to see what has been sending, sitting, sending, si <laughs> what has been sitting underneath shelves. Whoo! Stumbled over my words there. Sitting underneath uh, the. <laughs> I promise I'll get through this. What has been sitting underneath shelves for all of these years, and we definitely found some pretty interesting stuff. So uh, go and check out that video. I'll link you up at the very end of today's video. It's. It's early in the week for me. You know, I'm trying to get back into the motion of things. That's what happens at the beginning of the week. All right, there is our foil. There is our code card right there going to a 20th anniversary box. Venusaur, not bad. And our coin going to a Lucario. And that is it for the very first mystery power box. Let's go into the second Pokemon mystery box opening. All right, here we go. Just opening up, you know, just three of them. That's all. N nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. I don't usually end up pulling the vintage packs. You know, anytime any of you have ever seen me open up a Pokemon mystery box, my luck with these is not good. <laughs> it is not good at all, but I try my best. I keep moving forward. I would like to pull a vintage pack every single time I open up one of these Pokemon mystery boxes, but... For me, it just doesn't happen. But you know what? I don't let that ruin my fun. I'm just here to enjoy some Pokemon, and that's exactly what we do, Breaking Family. Going into, oh my goodness, but we are definitely, definitely getting the Rainbow Rare pulls today. Solgaleo and Lunala from Cosmic Eclipse. Are you kidding me right now? We have gotten two Rainbow Rares, one in the first box, one in the second box, and honestly... I'm sorry, Eternatus. I like this one a lot more. Solgaleo and Luinala. Beautiful, beautiful card breaking family. We are having a whoop. There we go. A fantastic day when it comes to uh, cards from the booster packs themselves. As far as vintage packs, having a little bit of a rough day, but that's perfectly okay. That's perfectly okay. I'm having a good time, and I appreciate every single one of you stopping by to hang out with me and enjoy some Pokemon today. And if you're new here to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Become part of the Breaking family. I would definitely, definitely appreciate it. On our way to 600,000 subscribers here on YouTube. Larvitar! We got a Pupitar. Wow. All fighting. Do you see that? All fighting back-to-back. Going into a, a random receiver and a full art Kingra EX. Are you kidding me right now? Because we are on a river. We are floating on a river of ultra rares. That's right, breaking family. A full art Kingra EX from Fates Collide. Another beautiful card. Whoop! Right up there in the VIP section. There is the code card for that one. Whoosh! I'll put that right back there. Going into, well, there's the code card, but Darkness Ablaze with Charizard on the pack artwork. 
All right, here we go. I, I'm telling you, if we end up pulling another Ultra Rare out of this box, we might just have to quit. No, I'm not going to, but we'll, we'll keep moving forward. Ducklet, not the duck we're looking for. We're looking for that Psyduck. Energy, Semi-Seer, Doug Trio, going into a Corviknight and a Clink Clank for the rare. Clink Clank. Did I say Clank or Clank? Did I? I don't remember which one I said. I don't, I don't know. I feel like I, I thought I said Clank. Clink Clank. Maybe I said Clink Clank. <laughs> I don't know, as you can tell, I'm just having a good time today. Just having a good time being myself, and I always encourage you to be yourself as well. Don't be ashamed of who you are. Be proud of who you are. The world needs more people being themselves. Just being themselves and not trying to be like anybody else, not trying to please anybody else. Just be you and be proud of who you are because you are the only one like you on this entire world, and you should be proud of that. You seriously should. Okay, last one. We have a Steam Siege. And that is it for the packs inside of that first one. All right, Steam Siege, what do you have to offer us today? We have a Nose Pass going into a Ponyta. Bravery, fly away, fly away. Clang, Ninja Boy going into a Weavile. There's the code card for that one. If you didn't see the code card from earlier that was in the box, it is a mythical Pokemon collection, Arceus. And then last but not least, we have ourselves a Pikachu coin and a Dusclops. The foil cards could just be a little bit better. Just a little bit better if I was to show any sort of criticism, but you know, can't, can't have everything you want, right? You just gotta, sometimes you just gotta take what you can get, right? If you're just given a dust clops, you just take the dust clops, right? No complaints, no complaints. Okay, going into our last Pokemon Mystery Power Box. All right, here we go, Breaking Family. Let's see what we got in our last one. Celestial Storm. Are we gonna go three for three when it comes to the Rainbow Rares inside of these Pokemon Mystery Power Boxes? Celestial Storm, definitely another set that I'm having a difficult time finding currently in stores. Torchic, Energy, Pelipper, Soul Rock, Jirachi Prism. Hey, there we go. That's a beautiful card. And you can see it's a little bit, a little bit off center or miscut. Uh, uh, maybe a little bit miscut, but hey, not bad at all. Going into a Regice. Let's go ahead and sleeve up that Jirachi Prism. Whoop. Right up there in the VIP section. There's the code card for that one. If you didn't see last Saturday's video, oh, Ancient Origins. Are you kidding me right now? Yes, definitely. We'll take some Ancient Origins. Woo, nice. But yeah, if you didn't see last Saturday's video, um, I actually came across a content creator on TikTok and uh, he ended up finding a Neo Discovery booster pack at a pawn shop for only $25, he bought it. And when I saw this video, I was absolutely intrigued. Oh, okay, Regis and Registeel. I was intrigued what is inside of this booster pack and I offered to buy it off of him. I was like, hey, I, I, I wanna know what's inside this booster pack, I'll buy it from you. Uh, he declined the offer of the purchase, but was very nice and uh, offered to come here on the channel and open up that Neo Discovery booster pack. So uh, go and check out last Saturday's video. I can link that up at the very end as well. Um, but I invited him here on the channel. Uh, he opened it up and he might be a little shocked at what was inside of it. So uh, go and check that out. Switch, Moldor, Snubble, going into a crab abominable for the rare. Okay, no ultra rare out of this one so far. We have two booster packs left. Yes, two booster packs left. We have a Cosmic Eclipse. The back of it right there kind of threw me off just for a minute. I thought we had something just a little bit different, but Cosmic Eclipse, I'll take it. I'm not complaining. Cosmic Eclipse getting a little bit harder to find as well. Lit Leo, that doesn't mean the Pokemon Company won't print more. Blue Bay Bay, A Bay Bay. Not to fly away, not to. Energy, put that right back there. You have to do that. Every time you pull an energy, I encourage you throw the energy and yell energy. And Empoleon for the rare. There's the code card right there. 
We have code card going into Detective Pikachu case file. Our coin, a Pikachu. Make sure you look in the video description for all of my social media and whatnot down there. Ah, our foil card is going into a wishy-washy. Put that over there. And our last booster pack is a Darkness Ablaze. No vintage pack, but that's perfectly okay. We have a chance at a Charizard inside of this pack. All right. Are we going to go three for three when it comes to rainbow rares? We have a Gothita, Skarmory, Cub Chew, Wimpod, Energy, Struggle Gloves, Combuskin, Pupitar, Simiseer. There's the code card right there. What is inside of this last booster pack? It's all boiling down to this last card right here. Will it be a rainbow rare or will this last Pokemon mystery power box Disappoint us. Oh! You ruined the party! Breaking family, that's it for today's Pokemon opening. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out these videos right over here. I'll see you all in the next video. And I truly love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.